Are you tuned into my fair swings and right now again we got Luke James with us. What it is, bro? Not much. How you been? Oh man, working harder, work harder, having a good time though. I know that's right. Mm -hmm. Thanks again for this uh interview because it's definitely been a couple months. Last time we were in Delaware. Yeah. Now we had SOBs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Long time. Yes, and options is out. Hot single. Tell um everybody about how you came up with the approach for that, because that record is definitely dope. Uh, the song is a it's a very personal song. You know, um very compelling kind of record and and I feel it's a universal record, uh, so it just felt only right to do such a record. Mm -hmm. uh, the collaboration with having Rick Ross on it just made proper sense because of how intense the song is and what the song is talking about. I wanted it to be, if it were to have a feature, I wanted it to have a, someone who had a voice that our generation adheres to. And Rick Ross is one of those voices. Absolutely. Yeah. And so now, is Rick Ross going to be the only one that's going to be collaboration-wise on this album, or do you got some more under your uh, belt? Uh, there may be some, some more. I, uh, I'm reluctant to, to tell because I, I just want people to go get the album and you'll be surprised. It's a good movie. This is a prelude mm -hmm. to the Luke James story. Right. That's what this album Self-titled Luke James, September Absolutely. 23rd. Absolutely. So you changed the uh, title from Made to Love to Luke James. Yep. What made you want to um, change it to a self-titled versus uh, Made to Love? Growth, you know, um, a whole lot of living, and it just feels right to call the initial, uh, the official album, the first real step, big step, um, name it after me. Right. You know, um, Made to Love is sure to come down the line somewhere, mm -hmm. you know, one of the chapters. Okay. So yeah. probably maybe like the second or third? Possibly. Okay. Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. So now, um, a lot of, the big thing a lot of people wanted me to ask you was, um, Torn. You mm -hmm. went on tour with Beyonce, mm -hmm. and I know the last time we talked, you had said how that was a big experience, how that was a big collaboration for you. Mm -hmm. Now, as far as, like, you know, going in doing this album, what tour do you want to, um, or perform with, or anybody this time around? Oh, wow, that tour was absolutely amazing. And shouts out to B. Thank you so much. Thank you to the, to the Carter family, the team. Um, and thank you to the Destiny's Child fam. They've always been big supporters of mine since day one. I'm so appreciative to, to that family. Um, I'm looking forward to jumping on, on stage with with, the, with anybody who's willing to uh, broaden their horizon, expand their territory, mm -hmm. and, and not just be, uh, you know, not be simple-minded. I mean, I, I, if I'm using the right words, I, I, I want to do something that's worldly. I want to continue to do things that are worldly. Beyonce is worldly. I want to. I want to expand with other artists. I want to collaborate with other artists who, who not 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 only see what's in front of them, but see what's beyond, and want what's beyond. Them. Mm. That's dope. Yeah. That's got me thinking. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Luke. Well, thanks so much uh, for this interview. Tell everybody who might be you know late mm -hmm. on the the movement. Tell them where they can um, catch up with you. You can, you can catch up uh, with me on my website, officiallukejames.com, or Twitter, who is Luke James, or Instagram, Wolf James, W O L F James. Yes, like the animal. Oh yeah. Um, album self-titled Luke James. Coming out September 23rd. Luke James, September 23rd. Nope. Thank you so much. Anytime. Man. Yes, sir.